Hello, kid. Well, let me ask you something today. What do you do when you're hungry? You go and take a packet of biscuits or chips to eat. And if you don't find it, you go up to your parents and tell them. So, they cook food for you, right? Now, what happens to a plant when it feels hungry? Can it go and eat a packet of chips? Not really. Well, can the plant ask its mother to cook food for it? Not really. Even if you see, plants can't even move just like we do. We can go to the market and get food for us. But a plant cannot move. So, then how come they eat food? From where do they get it as well? Have you ever thought about it? Let me tell you. Well, the plant can make food for itself. Doesn't it sound interesting? Well, it is. But how do they make it? Let me tell you. Well, for example, you want to make a sandwich, right? So, what do you need to make this sandwich? First, you need the bread. Then, the cucumber. Then, tomatoes and cheese. Finally, you take two slices of bread and put everything between them. Finally, your sandwich is ready to eat, right? Similarly, there is another easy recipe as well, which is to make raw fruits and yummy vegetables. But can you make raw fruits and vegetables? Not really. Only plants can make raw fruits and vegetables. But how do they make it? Well, they take sunlight, water and the air which we breathe out. And with the help of these three things, that is sunlight, water and air which we breathe out, they make food and along with these three things do you know what is required well the only thing required other than these three are it should be a plant with leaves so leaves help the plant to make food see over here you have got the sunlight the water and the air with the help of all of these three things, the plant makes food. And what is this process known as? It is known as photosynthesis. So, this is known as photosynthesis. So, the plant requires sunlight, air, water along with the green leaves to make their food. And this process is known as photosynthesis. So, what is photosynthesis? The process by which plants use sunlight, water and air to make their own food is called photosynthesis. See, air, water and sunlight together along with leaves make food for plants. So, let me ask you a question. What is the process by which a plant 
makes food? Is it option one sedimentation or option two photosynthesis? Let me tell you. Well, just now we learned the process by which plants make their own food using sunlight, air, water and leaves is known as photosynthesis. So this is a correct option. And number one, sedimentation is a wrong option. So the plants are so good and friendly to us that they not only make their own food, but also make these delicious fruits and vegetables for us so that we can also eat it. So next time when you want food, remember how our plant friends make food for themselves. And I'm sure you would also be glad to have these delicious fruits and vegetables given by our plant friends. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. You can also register for free at deltastep.com to get all the learning resources as per ICC, CBSC, IB, Cambridge or any other curriculum. More than 5000 plus amazing lectures across maths, science, English and social studies. Our unique interactive video technology keeps you engaged and our iDictionary feature allows you to quickly revise any concept. Master each topic at your own pace with our adaptive practice technology and 1 million plus questions. Get instant answers and detailed solutions. Be exam ready by taking unlimited mock tests. Performance analysis along with actionable feedback. Personal tutors to resolve your slightest of doubt. That's not all. You can also win amazing prizes like playstations, iPads, watches and many more along with certificates through our Earn As You Learn program. So at deltastep.com learning is not only fun and easy but also rewarding. So register for free now.